Okay, we made it now to the Dairy Market and I'm gonna show you a little bit around. It's like the Chinatown of Korea. Leah? Yeah. Hi! Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today, we are visiting Dairy Market. You can see many Chinese restaurants and stores lining through the main street. And those neighborhoods are filled with people from Taiwan, Hong Kong, China and a lot more and I really really liked it and you almost feel like you're really in China you can find many Chinese dishes there and supermarkets even hairdressers and so much more This was my first visit and I think it was really interesting also to see another part of Seoul most foreigners don't really visit or don't know so I hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog and, and maybe come and visit it on your own one day beca because it is really interesting and so much more different than all the tourist hotspots There are so many things, just look at it. Wow. We're like the only tourists here. Hi everyone, I'm back in my dorm. Um, for today, we have visited the Dairy Market, as you have seen. Um, it is called like the little Chinatown of Seoul, which is pretty cute. In this area, almost every shop is in Chinese. Even the menu, everything is Chinese. You hear so many people talking in Chinese. And I have to admit, before I went there, I was like, it's gonna be like in London because that's like the only Chinatown I've been to before and I thought like it would be just like Chinese restaurants or like Chinese dishes and stuff but no, actually there is a lot 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 Chinese and um, like I feel, I, I kind of feel like the main language there is like Chinese um, but it's pretty cool in my opinion there were also like Chinese hairdressers, Chinese restaurants, Chinese everything like I was actually blown away I wasn't expecting that so um, and and as you have seen in my video I went with a friend of mine and we were like really literally the only foreigners there so um, people kind of stared at us but it wasn't like bad because like you know I know I look like a foreigner sometimes I might not look like a foreigner because um, I got some oranges at the market because they were really cheaper there it was kind of outside of so like it was still so but those are actually so so expensive in Seoul um, but they were really cheap in my opinion like for Seoul they were cheap as fruits um, so I was really happy and I got like a whole pack you know when I paid them um, the guy I don't know why I mean I'll, I always think I look like a foreigner I mean even with a mask on, I think you can see that I'm a foreigner. But I, I don't know, like, sometimes people think I, like, I don't know if they think I'm Korean, but like, he, like, didn't really, maybe he didn't really look at me, but then he, like, started talking in Korean, and I was like, what? Well, because I was, like, just like, it was everything went so fast, and I was like, what is he talking about? And then he said to me, oh, you're not Korean. <laughs> I was like, nay, hey, I'm not Korean. It was just like, oh, I'm sorry and stuff. It was kind of weird, but also really funny. And yeah, it was my second time being mistaken for a Korean person in a month. Not even a month that I'm out. That's so crazy. But um, I think it's nothing bad. I think people just don't really look at me. But I think they weren't ready to uh, um, see a foreigner in the market because as I said, they weren't 
any foreigners beside us so uh, at least I haven't seen them and people kind of stared at us but uh, you know I have no problem because I know I'm a foreigner I know that I look different so I'm kind of used to it you know <laughs> if you have any questions regarding the market anything um, leave it down in the comments I'm more than happy to answer them don't forget to give this video a like up thumbs up don't forget to leave a nice comment down below subscribe to my channel to never miss a video or a vlog or an upcoming Q&A so, so if you have any questions leave it down below as well um, then if you don't want to miss any of these then activate the bell and yeah see you in my next video I plan to do actually more vlogs now um, also on Wednesday and Saturday or Sunday, I have to see how my schedule is with school, how much I have to learn and stuff. I wanted to upload more again, like twice a week. So yeah, I hope you guys are looking forward for that. Um, and see you in my next video. Bye!